Hi friends, have a nice day. Let's simulate a double clipper. For constructing a double clipper, we need two diode, a resistor, source, then the ground point and power. We are doing the simulation in P space. We can take the components from this icon, get new part. By clicking here, we can type the part name and select the component. First, a resistor or just click on place and place the component. Then, next, diode. Diode, we are selecting D1 and 4002. Place. For rotating it, control R. Okay. Then we are using the double clipper. So one facing the anode and one facing cathode. This is facing the cathode to the resistor. So next one. The anode should be faced towards the resistor. Then we want the source. For getting the source, we are typing the syntax. Sorry, uh, we are typing V sign. Select the V sign, place. Okay, then we want a DC source for that VDC. We are giving the positive side to the mm, cathode that is positive clipper with the sorry negative clipper with the positive voltage then here positive clipper with the negative voltage for getting negative voltage we have to rotate the uh, DC source for rotating we are using the simple sorry uh, called keyword uh, is control R. One more, okay. Then placing. Okay. Now we have to get the down point. For getting down, we are using GND underscore Earth. This one. Place and close placed here then unselecting this just escape press escape then we have to wire the model for getting wire we are using this icon okay For connecting, we are clicking on the tip of this point, this one, to this, then to this, this, okay, this we can connect all the terms, you see, Okay, connect with the old parts. Now let us assume that uh, we are giving a 3 volt supply uh, to the negative side and a positive side. That means uh, negative clipper with the minus 3 volt and a positive clipper with the plus 3 volt. For uh, giving the supply value we have to double click on this we are giving 3 volt here also 3 volt ok 
than the DC source value by double clicking here you can change the values uh, DC voltage 0 yes we have to save then AC voltage again 0 save offset voltage 0 the amplitude we are giving 10 volt okay then frequency 1 kilohertz 1k okay yes now we can simulate before that we have to save the circuit which we are saving we are giving a name Now we have to do the electrical rule check. First, we have to check the electrical rule check. Okay, there's no problem. Then create net list and this created. Then we have to give the setup here. Click the transient response. Print step from one nanosecond to one millisecond, which will show the one cycle of the frequency input signal. We can give a step of ceiling. I'm giving point zero one millisecond. We have to give the probe also. We are taking the voltage probe, place here and here. Now we have to simulate for that. In analysis tab, click on simulate. Simulating out will, output will be in the another window. We have to take that. Okay. Let's see this. This is our input, which is shown in the red color. Our output is shown in green color. We are given 3 volt for the positive clipping and the 3 volt for the negative clipping. That's why, which is giving. 3 point something that is 3 plus 0 0.6 voltage drop of that particular diode here we can see that this is the 0 this is 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 the clipping is shown here that means in between 3 and 4 it's around 3.6 here also it's around 3.6 this is our output uh, we can vary the clipping area by changing the supply voltage okay that's all thank you